Oh no, no, no. I'm, I'm sorry. Your clan? Alta Caldos. Yes. They're dead. All of them. Shreds if we get too close. Can we take it down somehow? Mitch! He's alive! They have them! Maybe. But we have to get there first. doing why in the hell were they following the av the fools probably keeping helmet in the av mind that launcher it will blow us to bits if we approach okay here's the plan you stay in the car no I... not so fast i will go with you those are my people pan am hate to break it to you but you're hurt wait in the car i'll try and take out the launcher i Fine. But I have Mitch's rifle. I will try to cover you from here. Good idea. Let's move. Took him out. You are instructed to reveal yourself. Locating suspect. You are instructed to reveal no. yourself. Locating suspect. I just wonder.
Path clear. I'm coming for you. Nice. Too late for everyone to walk out of this alive. We called for backup! Bullshit! Last chance. You don't gotta die today. Let's talk. Why should I believe you? Pan Am, shoot Listen. Up. This isn't about you. Let him go and tell me where I, your passenger is. I, I don't know where they took him. Hell no! He's lying! Look you, you got two seconds to make up your damn mind. Alda Caldo's right up here I, any minute now. They're headed west, for the gas station. But I can't guarantee they're still there. You remember the Shut cowboy. Shut the fuck up! Fuck! Pan Am! God damn it! Oh shit. Are you alright? Nah, just some scratches. You fucking morons! Did you get hit? Hang on, girl. I'll patch it's you up. It's nothing. We couldn't retreat, Pan Am. They regrouped so fast. Started shooting rockets and shit. I lost everyone. Everyone? Scorpion, is he here? Mitch? Mitch? He's... He's safe, Pan right? Pan Am, I'm sorry. I didn't make it in time. No. No! Are you sure? No, he... That pilot didn't have to die. He was this close to KV. He was armed. He was terrified. All he wanted to hear was he had a chance to get out of this alive. Save your breath, V. I could not risk the life of a friend. The one I still have left. I wonder what you would have done in my shoes. Uh, you're right. Would have done the same. He'd still be more useful alive than dead. Come on. Do you really think he would have taken you to Helmet? That you would have exchanged hostages? People who fly those AVs are the best of the best. Trained right and paid better. That pilot never would have gone against procedure. Wouldn't have had the balls. Do you really believe he broke? He was just looking for a chance to pull that trigger on us. I need the man who was riding this AV. Pilot said they headed west. Yep. Took him with them. In our cars. Pilot was telling the truth. There's an old gas station out there. Must be looking for a way to call base. So you're the ones who hit him with that EMP? Yeah, we tried to warn you, but couldn't connect. What's the plan now, V? <laughs> Pan Am, listen. I know it's not the best time, but I need Hellman. You promised to help. That still hold? I always keep my word. Mitch. I will find those sons of bitches. I swear. Go. I'll call the crew. Get all this cleaned up. We'll leave my ride here just in case. Just watch the gun. It likes to jam. We'll go by bike. Sounds good. If they made it to the station, they're probably waiting on backup. Better hurry. But Pan Am... What? You're coming back for her, right? I promise. Let's get going. Before they send a rescue party. Scorpion and the rest. Look, I know how you feel. I mean it. I'll help you settle your score with Kang Tao. I will destroy them. Every last one of them. Is that a problem for you? No, and you know it. We're in this together. To the bitter end. You know what, V? You're all right. You helped me with Nash. You helped me with Mitch. To my mind, I owe you a favor. Your helmet. I will find him. Ah, so that's what this is? Just paying your debts? No. Nomads always help Oh, so I'm one of yours now. 
Sounds good. Let's delta to that station. Hope you know a shortcut. Mm-hmm. Get ready. The bikes are fine. Hop on. Trust me, you don't want it with the problem, cap. Scorpion said I would hate Night City. You knew you that well? Probably better than I know myself. He said when I'd had enough of the city, we would get ourselves an RV. Then we'd stock up and hit the road. Crater Lake. That was his big dream. Where it is beautiful there. And that Ryan Deemer's car is rusting at the bottom. What? Who? That corporal. He stole some sort of prototype. I think it was Militech. You don't remember? Anyway. Chase a guy from three states, only to fish his body up out of the lake. Killed himself? Got it. I think they hit him with a virus. Anyway, lost control. Probably suffocated before he could drown. That is fucked up. You stop thinking about all that sad shit for a moment, right? <laughs> Oh shit, the fuck was this?
Surrender! You have no chance of escaping! Why can I not reboot? Understand these bugs, man. Why is it blocked? Oh shit. I'm gonna hate that. God. Damn, I blew myself up.
attacking me! I'm in. Hellman, he has to be here. I need cover. Oops, that shot? He's a goddamn extremist. Find Hellman at the gas station. Drop that milk toast tibble and rush to the nearest store for a taste of sweet, 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 clean speed. Because life is too short to be slow. Don't shoot, I'm unarmed. The hell are you doing here? This is my station. Name's Marty. Those fucking suits rode up like they own the place. Took everything. Put me here and locked the door. Brought a man with them. 
A man I need. Civilian. You must have spotted him. Mm-hmm. I ain't blind. Where are they holding him? Old garage. Room upstairs. Probably keeping him there. Thanks. I were you, I'd stay put for a few. Exactly my intention. Know where they're keeping Hellman. Going in. Okay. Covering you. Don't look too concerned. Ain't my first rodeo. Once the dust falls, the problems disappear one way or another, and I... I just dust myself off and get back to work. Know what they wanted? Anything? Had some sort of accident. Wanted to call someone in town. Tell me they didn't. Like to hear that, wouldn't you? Not your lucky day, boy. <laughs> I thought you wanted to talk. Who sent you? Hey, easy. We gotta talk. Who are you working for? You're in Obu Arasaka. Do you wish to take me back? Pathetic or? rat's got nowhere left to scurry off to. He's out of lifelines. Shut him up already. Not a fan, I take it. You haven't found a fan in him either. Motherfucker doesn't know who to be scared of more. You or Arasaka. Don't take this personally. I seem to recall you were gonna tell Takamura when you got Helmet. Yeah, just a sec. I'll call him. Just remember, you have Helmet, and that's one hell of a card. Try to win something with it. Takamura saved my life, remember? Because it was in his fucking interest to do so. Still just biz. He's no friend of yours. Takamura, good news. Got Hellman. Alive. What did he say? Alive, alive. Not too talkative now. Taking him to the Sunset Motel. I will come to you. Keep him there until I arrive. You got it. See ya. Better take him somewhere you can talk in peace. True. Looks like your new Chimbas are here. Is that him? Sure is. Take him outside. Toss him on the bike. Stay right there. The cavalry has arrived. Mitch gathered together a few elder colonies. <coughs> the road was clear. I don't think we were spotted. We would still do better not to hang around too long. What do you plan to do with him? Just gotta ask him a few important questions. I sure hope you get some important answers. Saul. Everything's done here. All clear. I heard Mitch is alive thanks to you. Thanks to V and Pan Am. They both saved my ass. I just hope he was worth it. Saul, I tried to raise Scorpion. Maybe I could help out somehow? I think you've helped enough. I tried to stop him. Sure. Just turn around now. Let it all be damned. You're good at that, aren't you? Thanks for the support. You helped us, we help you. Have a safe return. Damn it all. <laughs> hey, don't worry about Saul. He'll get over it. I don't give a damn. But he gives a damn about you, Pan Am. As soon as he heard what had happened, he ordered us to follow you. He was worried something would happen. Saul? That was his? Look, maybe you two don't see eye to eye at the moment, but your family and Saul will do anything for family. The thing is, am I even part of the family anymore? You know you are. Come back to us. <laughs> I understand. Sorry you had to witness that. Things just get...
complicated. Dramatic sometimes. But I will manage. And you. You look out for yourself, all right? So, what now? Back to Night City? Yeah. I mean, I think so. I have to sit and think. About everything. And that's it. Until next time. They're coming. You got a minute. Let's move. Until next time. Take care of Scorpion's bike. It's yours now. Yeah, that wouldn't be the easiest thing to ride with that guy passed out on there. Hey. <laughs> Where am I? What is this place? I want to talk about your little invention. Biochip you made for Arasaka. Fine. But let's get one thing straight first. Yorinobu Arisaka didn't send you? No. This means you must have an offer for me. If your boss will pay more than Kang Tao, I believe we can talk. Nobody sent me. I got a problem, and you're gonna help me. And what does that have to do with the biochip? Got Silverhand's construct in my head. It's literally driving me crazy, and I know it's only gonna get worse. That is, unless I remove it. And that, none of that's on the billboards I saw. Not even in the fine print. Constructed, that's impossible. Where did you get this biochip? Do you wish to know more about your condition? Clept it off Yorinobu Arasaka. Job for a client. But the client left me out and of And you decided the best place for it was in <laughs> your own goddamn head. Actually, wasn't a bad idea. Construct rebooted me when my own goddamn head took a bullet. I always knew Yorinobu's plan would fail. I just never imagined it would turn out like this. Arasaka's prized tech really is in the very streets of the city. You have to remove the biochip from my system. It's not that simple. Look, you made the thing, didn't you? So where's the problem? If you're telling the truth, you slotted in a new experimental version of the biochip. How's the prototype version different? It's got a different engram, something more... Aware. Aggressive? The biochip is what's unique, not Silverhand's engram. The previous version of the chip was only used to communicate with pre-saved And it was rare as fuck and cost a fortune. Yeah. This one's rarer. Meant to install and activate the engram in a new body. When I left Arisaka, the project was still in the trial phase. <laughs> How do you put a price on immortality? Who could even afford tech like this? Nobody. This model was meant to remain in-house. The prototype was Saburo Arasaka's personal commission. He oversaw the entire project himself. So if it weren't for Yorinobu, nobody would have found out. And if not for you, the project would not have been a success. This is a true breakthrough. How exactly was this new version supposed to work? Were you planning to have the engram kick people out of their own bodies? Is that shit by design? During the tests, we assumed that the body would be Neurally indifferent during implantation. You mean dead? Yes, which makes what happened to you interesting indeed. Yeah, yeah, great. Your tech works. Now get it out of me. Well, well. I would have to see it first. Whoa, we just met. <laughs> Haven't built up that sort of trust yet. How did you think this was going to go? If you want me to help you, I must examine you. Okay. Hmm. Unbelievable. It looks like... Can't believe this Seuss the one who's gonna help us. Huh. 
Oh, fuck. What? What is it? What a pity I won't be able to examine it fully. Yeah, real shame. You could have been his guinea pig, too. Tell me how to get rid of it. I'm afraid I have bad news. Your neural network has completely deteriorated. It can no longer function independently of the chip. The only thing I could Woo do... Woohoo! It's bargaining time! ...is to give you information on a good clinic in Sweden. <laughs> They'll help you through the terminal stages. Minimize the pain. Wait, you said the project was in the trial phase. You don't actually know how it'll end. Oh, I do. I just saw the construct devouring your brain. It's programmed to take over its new environment. At all costs. And your little meat brain is helpless against it. So no matter what, sooner or later the engram wins. Yes. And from what I've heard about Silverhand, that seems to be exactly his style. Huh. I see my reputation's grown into What exactly is going on in my head? You tell me. What's it like to have two personalities? Because it's not like you're hearing voices. You are both yourself and Silverhand, simultaneously. I can see him and talk to him. You're not talking, but yes, I understand what you mean. Have you noticed the Construct's influence on your decision-making? Sheesh, give it a rest. When it comes to my decisions, Johnny really is just a voice in my head. Maybe he has a different opinion, but he can't make me do anything. Agreed 100%. You are one fucking stubborn It's host. not as if one of you wins the debate. The scale simply shifts, slowly but surely. What do you mean? You will start doing things that were once unthinkable, at least to your old self. And you know exactly who he was. A fanatic. A terrorist. A suicide bomber. Well, fuck me. Who's trying to mess with your head now? That is why I believe it would be better for you to consider clinical isolation at this stage. At least Johnny never whored himself out like you. Are you defending him? Or is that Johnny speaking now? Oh, let me guess. He already tried to take over your body. You know, just for a little while. No. Would you, though? Could be fun. Johnny. Kidding. But watch out. Suit's getting ready to talk your head off. Know what? That's enough. You just playing for time? Because I can't tell. Are you trying to convince me you're useless? Because, I mean, in that case, I can just shoot you in the head and save us both some time. Ah, oh, finally. I will try to help you. If you come with me to Kang Tao. I'll try. Just isn't gonna cut it. Actually, it's almost like you're trying to buy your way in with the Chinese. At my expense. Do you even realize how much data is in your head? Even if I can't help you, the data must be saved. Well, fuck me sideways. <laughs> what a half-brain gonk. He just Get admitted your wrong. Got any other ideas? If you think there's anyone else who can help you, I could give you the blueprints. Complete project documentation. Kang Tao offered quite the sum for it. You got it with you? He's got to. Gonk's fucking useless without him. The Takamura? What the hell is he doing here? He's got a few questions of his own for you. You play nice, he might even save your ass. I'm almost done. The blueprints. Just pulled that out of his keister. Better than nothing. Long as we find someone fluent in techno babble. What'll you do with him? I haven't decided yet. Are you serious? You know me. I can be impulsive. He's all yours. I'll give you two some space. I hope we can come to an understanding. That is certainly in your best interest. V, I will remember this. Ah, this heat. My throat is perfectly parched. Mm. You see we that? Did not Fuck give you me. Just look at that. Unacceptable. Inhumane. That is not. Good. You see? 
Sons of bitches. You really are paranoid. You don't see it? Wait, corpse are stripping our world and lives naked, piece by piece? Can't turn a blind eye to that. Whatever you gotta say, say it. Got something eating at your code, that's clear. Been trying to learn how you're wired this whole time. To know who I'm dealing with. Thought you were just unlucky at first. But I kept watching, and finally realized what your problem is. You were a kid from the Badlands. Family was your crutch and c But in NC, you're nobody. Best you can do is steal from scavs. The Merc Janitors. You seem to know a lot about my past. Well, seen flashes of your past, just like you've seen flashes of mine. Pisses me off that our memories blend. Don't have my own anymore. Ship's the worst thing that ever fucking happened to me. Mean to say I haven't earned the top spot yet. An arrogant asshole's no small problem, but it ain't my biggest. Dying is. Death by becoming someone else. You didn't do anything to deserve that fate. Are you afraid of death? I'm afraid of wasted opportunities. Like Arasaka Tower? Came through it as you can see, and I ain't done with them yet. Seems to me you need to have a nemesis at all times. Ideally, a crazy powerful one to feed your ego. And they gotta be practically unbeatable to justify a suicide run. Huh. You're funny. Actually, that's what I am. That kind of nemesis. I'll decide your fate. And then fuck all you can do. Okay. I'll tell you why I want to destroy Arasaka, but I'll only tell you once. Want to hear it? All right. I saw a corpse strip farmers of water, and eventually of land. Saw them transform Night City into a machine fueled by people's crushed spirits, broken dreams, and emptied pockets. Corps have long controlled our lives, taken lots, and now they're after our souls. Might be right. Can't really argue with you there. V, I've declared war not because capitalism's a thorn in my side or out of nostalgia for an America gone by. This war's a people's war against a system that spiraled out of our control. It's a war against the fucking forces of entropy. Understand? Do whatever it takes to stop them, defeat them, gut them. If I gotta kill, I'll kill. If I need your body, I'll fucking take it. Fucking hell. You still don't see it, but you will one day.